What's good, YouTube? It's your boy HK Reacts back in the reaction, and today we are reacting to a video by Him and Nations. I got a lot. I don't know if I'm saying that right. I, I think I am, though. If y'all don't, if y'all haven't seen the video I reacted to before on, my, on the channel about him, y'all should go check it out right now. It was really cool. But we're gonna see what he getting into. But with that being said, we at 831 subscribers, bro. Y'all know the goal is 835 by Monday. It was something else, but y'all smashed that goal, so I had to raise it, bro. So I know y'all can do it still, though. Let's hit that. You feel me? But let's get to this reaction. Yo. I'm not gonna lie, I'm I'm actually dumb. I just realized it's it's um H animations. Am I wait hold on time? Am I bugging? H animations. Haminations. Am I tripping? Am I tripping? Who cares, bro? Let's go. Y'all, let's get to this to the video. This is Haminations, my bully brother. Let's get to it. Hey! to the end of the video for a huge announcement. Oh, snap. Hello? Hello? Is this thing I love hot? animation videos, hey, bro. I ain't gonna lie. my brother has been bullying me a ton lately, but I've been studying his tactics get get and back. I know how to get him back. Get I've him. set up a bucket above his door so that when he walks through, he'll get soaked. Oh, here it comes. Okay, hi, IQ, please. What? Could, uh, use my own spells against you. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hi, I'm Bryson, and this is my older brother, Brayden. We're best friends now, but our relationship wasn't always like that. Brayden was a brother. total bully, and I was the innocent victim for our whole I'm the, I'm the youngest of four. I'm the youngest of anyway, you today, to like five or six. Back off, it's my I don't channel. care. I'm boss. You, no, I'm yeah, bigger. Yeah. I'm sorry. I have more money. You better lose. <laughs> oh, yeah. Anyway, hey, yeah. today, I wanted to reveal the money you some on of the fantastical stories of our sibling rivalry and how that blossomed that into a beautiful friendship. That's Let's every start feeling, at the beginning. Brayden had a huge problem with me minding my own business. I would just be chilling I in my room really... playing with Legos, and he would come in and knock them down. It's kind of like a beaver when it sees water. They both think, well, someone's got to put a stop to this. Hey, One time yeah. we were wrestling, and we had stuffed pillows under our shirts for protection. Brayden saw this and thought, oh, he's got a pillow under his you shirt. He's crazy. immune to all attacks, so it doesn't matter how hard I hit him. Then he kicked me into a stool. It dug into my unprotected oh. back and knocked the wind out of me. Oh! Okay, stop being so dramatic. <laughs> You're fine. Hey, yeah. Uh... Look, I'm thinking there's no reason we can't keep this little incident between us. Don't tell mom. Yeah, that's or I'll every order sim. Okay, all good. See you later. As every older Brayden sibling, himself bro. has told me that he didn't discover empathy until one day when he threw a pine cone at Brody's back and made him bleed. Oh. Anyway. He didn't apply empathy until several years later, though. Even now, his empathy is selective. Oh. Brayden loves pushing buttons. Growing up with him was a master class in making other people mad. And bothering me was easy. I just wanted peace, and Brayden knew exactly a how shark? to shatter that peace. Bruh. For example, for several nights in a row, I would be in bed, Brayden would come in and say, You've had it far too good for far too long. And then beat me up. Oh my. Hey, yo. After, I would say, Why? And he would say, No reason. Unprovoked. Anyways, see you same time tomorrow night. One time, we were on a family cruise, and Mom That's wanted it. us all to take a picture together. At this point, Brayden's button pushing and bothersome tendencies had infected all of us. It was like a virus. Brayden would bother me, and to blow off steam, I would bother Brenner. What a uh. healthy brother dynamic. Hurt people hurt people, what can I say? Am I right? <laughs> and further, <laughs> Brayden was an expert at making it seem like it was my fault and playing innocent. Oh so my. there we were, getting ready to take a picture, and Brody and Brayden decide this would be the perfect time to start grabbing my butt. Obviously, I get angry and start pushing and trying Pause. to get them to stop as they laugh at me. Mom hears the ruckus and, of course, assumes I'm just causing problems for no reason and says, Bryson, stop! So I tried to just deal with it and smile for the picture as my brothers laughed at me. Here is a recreation hey, of that yeah. picture. I lost on all accounts. I look super ugly because I'm trying not to squirm because my butt is being grabbed. Mom was mad at me and Brody and Brayden look great. They were experiencing the pure joy of a devious master plan coming together. They knew I had oh, no they, options, they devious. so their smiles are genuine. They devious, Neither all right. them had ever nor ever would again smile that brightly for any family photos. However, me and Brayden did have a team up on that same trip. Ooh. I was in the shower and Brenner kept turning off the light to bug me. I 
kept warning him that I would spit water on him if he kept turning off Ooh. the light, but that only strengthened his resolve to bother me. He would turn spit. it off and then run away down the hall over and over. Eventually, I asked Brayden to help me administer justice to Brenner, and he agreed. Wow. Brayden hid behind the door. Brenner came back and turned off the light, but before he could escape, Brayden grabbed him. Do it! Now! As I filled up my mouth with water to spray Brenner, I started laughing about how funny it was going to be when I sprayed him. But the laughter caused me to accidentally inhale the water. It all went in my lungs and I started coughing violently. <laughs> and something about that made my stomach go, Oh uh, yeah, he's coughing. Uh, let's just do a full reset. Send all stomach contents back from once they came, please. Beep. And I threw up in the shower as my brothers watched. I should have just thrown up on Brenner. He would have never bothered me again. But alas, now, here's you, another you lost example a brother of Brady's shenanigans infecting his fellow men. We were in high school at you this lost point, a brother, and bro. Brayden had taken a liking to flipping me off. However, <laughs> eventually, it just became an inside joke to us, and I would flip him off back. Hey, so, uh, we would hey, do hey. this all the time to each other as confused bystanders watched. It basically became our way of greeting each other. But one day, this harmless prank went quite wrong. We were getting food at a restaurant. I paid, oh, no. and the lady gave me my receipt, and I went to give her a thumbs up. But the habit hey, was so deeply ingrained yo. in me that I accidentally flipped her off. Hey, Luckily, yeah. <laughs> her head was turned, and as she turned back in the nick of time, I switched my hands to a thumbs up. That was the real life equivalent hey, of using yo. the wrong emote. I told Brayden about it and we <laughs> laughed and flipped each other off. Honestly, there aren't a ton of crazy stories of Brayden bullying me. It was more of an evenly spread slow okay, burn okay, that so. chipped away at my sanity for years. For example, hitting me unprovoked to keep me on my toes, stealing oh my. my stuff and hiding it, In picking me off the Xbox, giving me a disconnected controller to make you should have been playing the PlayStation anyways. Me think I was playing a video game with him, pushing me too hard on the rope swing so I would hit a tree, splashing me in pools, and throwing the hot potato at me way too hard, etc. That kind of stuff takes oh a my, that blood? small. That blood? It was a vicious <laughs> cycle of him purposefully aggravating me too much and me being too sensitive. And Man. there's no rhyme or reason to his crimes either. It usually plays out like this. Ugh. <laughs> what a brute. No matter. It's I know he's the, the music. He's trying to get a reaction out of me. Ew. Well, he's out of luck. I've gained total mastery over my emotions. That being said, I've got to find a way to get him back for this. Later tonight, I'll set a trap for him in his room. When he walks in, I'll be hiding in the closet with a water gun to soak him. And then I'll frame Brenner for it. It will be the perfect crime. Jesus. Laugh while you can, Brayden, because tonight, your reign comes to an end. <laughs> yes, sir, man. Huh. Prank him, John. All this That's being said, I ought to throw in at least one good story about Brayden because he truthfully is a great brother and I love him Shout out to Brayden, man. Dang. The year was 2017 and I was about to turn 16. The Nintendo Switch was releasing the next day and How I asked I? my parents if I could wake I up early, wait in line at the store, and buy the Switch with their man. money for my birthday. Since it would probably be out of stock everywhere by the time my birthday yeah, really did. Than that. They said no and I went to bed disappointed. Then man. at 5 a.m. Brayden woke me up and told me that mom and dad only told me no to make it a surprise and that we were going to the store to buy it now. It was a great brother experience and I'll always have fond memories of waiting in line with Brayden and playing Zelda. And here I am six years so later playing the new it. Zelda on that same release day switch. I'm tired of this grandpa. That's too d man. That being said, sometimes oh Brayden my. does half nice, half mean things. Hey, leave him alone, punks. He goes That's my room. job. Wow. Now, I don't claim to be the innocent victim in all these circumstances. I push Brayden's buttons too. As my mom taught us, it takes two for contention and I will not be one. But with me and Brayden, I would change it to, it takes two for contention and we will both be one. Dang. On that yeah, note, Brayden that. avidly claims that I once threw a full can of Sprite at his head. Ooh, I don't remember this at hurt. all, but admittedly, it's not fully out of character for me. And one time we were on a tandem kayak together and I was purposefully rowing out of sync with him so that our paddles would clank together. Right, left, Bruh. right, left. Do it right. I'm <laughs> trying. Sometimes I, I forget yeah, my hard. lefts and rights. Just follow my lead. That's left, actually hard to do. right, left, right. You're doing it wrong on purpose. Uh -oh. <laughs> what Put are you going to do about Put it? The boat. Tip me. We're on the same boat, idiot. Ah! You took the boat. But I 
also do nice things did. for him, like finding him a wife. Let me explain. One time, a bunch of families and friends in my neighborhood went on a big old camping slash hiking trip, and okay. I was eating lunch with our family friend, Kira. As we chatted and ate, I said to her, you should date Brayden. Mm, I don't think Brayden's really my type. Uh and I thought to myself, mm, sure he isn't, honey. And five years later, I was the best man at their wedding. Oh, wow. Well, it, Brayden owes his marriage to me. As That's such, lit. I will be naming the firstborn child. No. no. The baby's name will be Bryson 2. The sequel. Not, Not happening. happening. It's happening, guys. Here's another family love story. Brody brought home a girl named Jen uh, cool. to meet the family, so we decided to all play a board game together. It was a secret role game. We will call it Secret Bad Guy. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, in the board game, the good guys are Sorry, trying Among to figure us. out who the bad guys are and stop them to win. We got our secret roles and I was the bad guy. I had to keep my identity secret and convince everyone that I was a good guy. The game went on That's and us. it got to the point where if I was elected as chancellor, me and the bad guys would win. I had been purposefully playing in a way that had Brayden totally convinced that I was innocent. Mm. Mom was skeptical, but Brayden advocated for me and elected hey, me as chancellor hey, because I had earned his trust. The vote passed. If Bryson is the bad guy, then we lose. Bryson, you're not the bad guy, right? <laughs> hey, yeah. Uh... Hey, yeah. <laughs> Brayden was so angry that I had deceived him that he literally grabbed me, threw me on the table, and strangled me as I laughed. <laughs> At the family dinner, with the, with his Jen girlfriend there. In horror. What a great introduction to the family. I'm about to say. Somehow she ignored that red flag and married Brody anyway. The warnings were there. She signed up for this, so that's on her. See, and I'm not married. You did that, what I heard. <laughs> Speaking of board games, I only remember playing Monopoly once. All I remember is someone getting angry, grabbing the metal airplane piece, and, put and it where? throwing it like a ninja star out of anger. It missed and stuck into the oh wall. My. Good thing, too, it could have stabbed someone's eye out. I don't remember who threw it, it but I know I, in my heart that know. it was Brayden. Anyway, Thanks. as me and Brayden grew, we became best friends. Siblings are crazy like that. You spend your whole life fighting each other, and then one day you're both like, He was my best friend all along. For Brayden real. has blossomed into a great man, and I love him like a brother. Wait. Like, like a brother. Anyways, <laughs> despite Brayden trying to kill me over a board game, we still love them and we play them together all the time with nah, the family. Uno's, uno's, so much so that Brayden came to me right. one night saying that we should make a card game. That's way easier said than done, and I'm just not so sure that. And then the next morning, he sends a big document filled with all his ideas for the wow. game. Honestly, I was not expecting that, to like it, but after game. he pitched it, I realized he so, had uh, the seed of something great. And I was sold. Game. We spent the next several months writing the rules, play testing, Brayden brainstorming, balancing, creating prototypes, and mm. spending late nights together drawing out our ideas on paper cards. It's been super hard and has taken several months to get to this point, but also super rewarding. And so, without further ado, I'd like to introduce you to Hoard the Hams, a yes, Hamination's sir. card game where you hoard the most That's hams, steal hams from others, Hamination. and protect what you've got. This has been a labor of love from me, Brayden, and the whole family. Yes, but sir. we love the process so much that we're making our own family board game company. We already mm. have two more board game ideas we've wow. been playtesting, with two more promising ideas coming down the pipeline. That's crazy. So, if you want to support our family business while having a blast with your own family, please visit the Kickstarter to support and play Hoard the Hams today. This is a game that I genuinely Hamination, believe in. Man. We truly poured our hearts and souls into this, and we involved the whole family. It is our sincere hope wow, that wow, it will wow, be a blast wow, wow, that for hard. you and your wow, family, because wow, 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 it sure was a blast for me and mine. So please... Click the link below to learn more about Hoard the Hams. That's Supporting lit, the game will help us bring more card games and board games lit. to your family in the future. Thanks for watching. Yes, sir. Hey, y'all get y'all get y'all the Hamination game, bro. That's lit. What this is? Bryson's ham. There you go, little ham. I'll keep you nice and safe, and no one will ever. Huh? Ha! Looking for these? Whoa! What the happen? See a chump? Not so fast. Ha! This part of the game. It's like watching Yu-Gi-Oh! episode. <laughs> Face it, man. You've lost. Dang. I wouldn't count your hams before they hatch. <laughs> A trap? No! Wow. And I've still got an ace up my sleeve. Yo. Ha! Oh. This man turned the, the girl from the... What's her name? Captain no! Marvel? No! A hand Back animation now on game. Kickstarter. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Lit, Please consider supporting our hey. Kickstarter and share.
Make sure y'all go to Hammer Nation's page and show some love, bro. Get, cop that game. That game look lit. But um, what we learned today, keep your hands off Bryson's hams. You feel me? That's what we learned today, bro. So make sure y'all do that. I ain't going to lie. Bro, if y'all had brothers growing up like me, I had a hat. I have four brothers. Five. I don't know. How you, I don't even remember. I ain't gonna lie. But me personally, I was the youngest, so you know what that comes with, bro. Fighting for your life every day. That's what it was. But it, it's weird. Like you hit a certain age with siblings, where like y'all just like I don't know. It's like uh, for one point you hit them, and you hit a certain age. Now y'all cool. I don't know how to explain it, bro. This happens. If you have siblings, y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. But um, shout out to siblings, man. Siblings are lit. It makes, it makes the childhood a little more fun me, to me personally. But with that being said, if y'all didn't watch your dad's sub button, hit that like button, she plays Kim Yags. 831, bro, let's get to 835 by Monday. I know we can do it. And uh, we out of here.